Noah's Adventures on Legacy Farm presents. Okay, everybody, and welcome back to Noah's Adventures on Legacy Farm. And today, we are picking my 100 plus gourds that I planted um, earlier this year um, in the spring. And we're just going to plant them because in September 3rd, we um, enter my gourds into the fair. And so, yeah, we're picking them, and there's tons of them. Look at all that. And this <laughs> whoa, is a gourd I've never seen in my life. It's we got some crazy hybrids out here because we've planted in this certain spot for what three years, two years now. I think maybe three. Last year, a bit, this is all gourds. Yeah. Um, less. Yeah. And I have two of these. Um, they're really weird, but they're really cool at the same time. We got a ton of varieties. I think that's a cross between a um, birdhouse gourd and just a normal well, one of these. You've got a bunch of these over here. Yeah, be. there's a ton of these like egg gourds. Um, but, and we have these <laughs> giant sunflowers. Here, do that for size. Yeah, there's dad's hand. <laughs> Look, here's my hand up against it. This one is crazy tall. That one's probably eight foot. These are literally probably 18 inches around. I know, yeah. Like, and there's multiples of them. I mean, look at all of them. But yeah, there. As you can see, this is full of gourds. Usually, um, I wanted to weed eat all this, but um, a weed eater stopped working. So now we have to dig through all that. Yeah, there are a bunch of big ones back in there. Yeah. Um, we did plant some giant pumpkins, but they never sprouted, I guess. So, they're not here. But we have this giant garden spider right there. Hey, buddy. He's kind of cool. That's Come here. back in here, though. What's back here? There are a bunch of them. Let me show those. I think those are really pretty. I no. There? Yeah, there's tons of those. Those are kind of the biggest variety you have this year. There's nothing real large like last year. Yeah. Yeah, unless you plant them in a different plot, they're not going to be huge. But we did plant gourds in the back garden too. Not too much, but just some that came up randomly. So, yep, we're going to start picking. Okay, so we got two full totes of gourds, probably about, probably at least a hundred in each tote. Well, probably not that much in each, but there's no way to tell. There's a lot, but we just cut off one of the biggest sunflower heads and look at that. That's my hand on it. Yeah, that thing is really heavy and came off of that plant right there we got all kinds of awesome gourds they were all back in the corn back in those weeds that are taller than that thankfully there weren't any around the big old garden spider so we didn't have to go mess with him he's still there all chilling he's big um, but yeah, I think we probably got almost all of them. There's no way to know if you got all of them because there's so many. There are probably 20 little yellow ones up here. It's crazy. But these are the rest of our sunflowers. We grew several varieties this year um, down here. We have 
these, which are those, I think. And these are really awesome. These are, um, oh, there's a book. A little stingy thing. These are really pretty. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me. And, um, yeah, look at that. Those are so pretty. And we got all that, and there's acorn squash in here somewhere. Um, and look, we're growing hay bales. And, yeah, we grow, grew two hay bales. They just landed there somehow. <laughs> <laughs> Not really, but... <laughs> but our corn is starting to get some husks on it, or whatever you call that. That's nice. Tassel. Next. Oh, crazy. Daisy, you hot? You hot? <laughs> um, I will show y'all, um, just entering the gourds and all that into the fair. So, yeah. So, stay tuned. So, please subscribe, like, and stay tuned for more content like this. So, yeah. Goodbye.